Hey what's up guys welcome back The OnePlus 7 Pro will be releasing on 14th of May which is less than 10 days from now and I have already covered the Indian pricing of the OnePlus 7 Pro in my yesterday's video which you can check out from over here Okay so OnePlus is beating Samsung in their own game and this is not some sort of clickbaity title This is literally what is going on with OnePlus and Samsung. The OnePlus 7 Pro will use a UFS 3.0 storage and it's crazy fast. This is the difference between the new generation and the last generation of storage. And because of the new UFS 3.0, the OnePlus 7 Pro will indeed be faster and smoother. But you know, the real kick is that who makes these chips? Samsung. Yes, Samsung sells UFS 3.0 to OnePlus and uses UFS 2.1 on the Galaxy S10. For this I hit Samsung literally you know what it's like it's like that I have a Lamborghini and my enemy have a scooter and we both have a common destination to reach and I'm like dude take my Lambo I'll happily take your scooter because that will help me defeat a Lambo Samsung come on are you out of your mind I agree that Samsung doesn't give away these chips to OnePlus just from the goodwill of their heart. Samsung must charge a lot of money for that, but hey Samsung, at least at least use them on your phones also. The Galaxy S10 is more expensive and still lacks a couple of features. And the worst part is not that they lack a couple of features, it's that they themselves provide these features to other companies and still don't use it on their own phones. I'm a little bit sad for the price of the OnePlus 7 Pro. It should have been a little bit cheaper, but when Samsung does this type of stuff, I really want to become a OnePlus fanboy. Also the OnePlus 7 Pro gets HDR10 certification. It's the second smartphone to get this rating coming after the Galaxy S10. The OnePlus 7 Pro has a display almost comparable to the Galaxy S10 and OnePlus throws the Galaxy S10 out of water when it comes to refresh rate. It was Samsung's policy to not make better displays for others, but OnePlus must have given Samsung a great deal that they couldn't resist. Hey Samsung, I know you are getting a lot of money from OnePlus, but I think you should think your decisions twice. The display is literally the best part about your smartphones and you are like giving it away. OnePlus is beating you in your own game. They got better memory chips which you supplied and maybe they also have a better display now. So come on dude, what are you up to? Let me know guys what do you think about these decisions which Samsung is taking right now. I'll keep covering the OnePlus 7 Pro until it's released. So subscribe, hit that like button and as always, thanks for watching.